The uh -oh. monster. Oh, you said it, Cole. We knew this could happen. Oh, you knew, Cole? Here we go, and I hope, I sincerely hope, that the EMTs are ready to rush out here. I have a feeling this one will get ugly. If you take enough shots to the back of the head sooner or later, you're going to be seeing stars. Yeah, or at least looking up at the lights. Bang, right to the face. Well, out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation, and you can find yourself in a world of hurt. If there's one place you don't want to get puddles, it's your face. No kidding. Woo, that's hurting me. There are a lot of performers who have had a greater number of pay-per-view appearances than Brock Lesnar, but not many who have had a greater impact. You know, right from his very first year with the company in 2002, when he took down WWE Hall of Famer The Rock at SummerSlam, the Beast has taken part in some of the all-time most memorable pay-per-views. Great to see Lesnar back in the WWE ring. What are your thoughts on this legendary athlete? Definitely looking confident in this one-on-one -on -one environment. That's a good sign. Wow! If he keeps this up, this could be over quick! Oh, man, someone's got to stop this. Ferocity like this is in its own category. You don't launch an offensive like this unless your objective is to incapacitate your opponent. And to your point, King, of the epic pay-per-view events that Brock Lesnar has been a part of, I think it has been SummerSlam. Starting with that encounter with The Rock in 02, where the Beast has made his strongest mark. Victories over Triple H and CM Punk in 2012-2013 have made SummerSlam look like Brock's personal playground. It's crucial to remember Brock Lesnar is not a regular man. He's merciless. He's a beast. He's a conqueror with the intent to dismember opponents. He can raise his intensity with ease and throw his opponent smack dab in the middle of Suplex City. Somehow, he's kicked it into another gear here tonight. Staying on the attack. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. Those SummerSlam victories for Brock Lesnar over Triple H and CM Punk, two men that, and now Stone got it. You know, Stone is so dangerous inside that ring. Drops the knee with a vengeance. Oh man, he came down hard with that. No, oh, wait, nice reversal. This is a level of destruction no one was expecting. No kidding, this is getting ugly. Good grief! How is he still conscious? Oh man, is he fired up! Boy, he just got laid out! Back between the ropes. Look at this. He's going back to an old friend with that one. Yeah, you're right about that. You got to remember what works. Oh, he's in trouble now. Here we go. This could be it. F5 connects, and that has to be it. He looks absolutely unstoppable here. What a finishing move. This could be it right here. He is just getting busted up. You can bet every... Oh, oh my God! Warm up the buses. This one's over. Well, that steel chair has done the damage. He's pulling out all the stops tonight. He needs to dig way down deep if he wants to keep going now. Here we go. Wow, what a move from Brock Lesnar. That's how you sweep an opponent under the carpet. Oh, man, how do you stand after an attack like this? Look at this. He's just barely moving. I'm not sure he can get back to his feet. This one's over. You're right, Cole. Nobody gets up from an F5. He 
He's too busy bragging and boasting than battling in this matchup. I don't know how much longer he's going to be able to go. Executed perfectly. And check out the look of satisfaction in those eyes. Well, I don't know if you would categorize this as innovative offense, but it sure gets the job done. Just look at what's going on here. It is human destruction. A fever pitch is here in the WWE Universe. You're right about that. The crowd is buzzing. They're ready for this thing to get underway. The tension, the drama. This is electric. Look at the back of my arm, Cole. Look at the goosebumps. I love this. What an attack. Take it from me, there's never a good place or a good time to get hit. WWE's not like other sports where you call a timeout after a major hit. The match goes on. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. Wow! If he keeps this up, this could be over quick. What we're witnessing here is surreal. The beast, Brock Lesnar, is lethal as is. But now it's like he's running on unlimited energy. He's impervious to pain. This is when an anatomical juggernaut like Brock Lesnar is even more dangerous and more deadly. God help us all. Whoa! A direct hit. Talk about getting tagged and knocked in the middle of next week. Uh-oh, look at this! And now Stone got it. You know, Stone is so dangerous inside that ring. Right on the shoulder. You know, that bone in there, the clavicle, is extremely easy to break. Oh, <laughs> what a shot. That did some serious damage. You can't take too many of those and expect to be in the match much longer. Both of these competitors have so much resolve. Ow! Ooh. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. You're watching SummerSlam, truly one of the most historic events in the history of sports entertainment. It all started in 1988 when SummerSlam emanated from New York City. The main event for that inaugural event, the Mega Powers versus the Mega Bucks. He did it! What a huge win! And here's some highlights from the matchup. Here's your winner, representing Team Hardcore, Brock Lesnar!